on this very spot on Friday is where all the commotion happened. With the SWAT team on alert and officer on leave, citizens are left with unanswered questions and tension in their neighborhood. On Friday evening, young residents of the Craig Ranch neighborhood in McKinney planned an end of the year cookout that turned into a national story. So when we first got there, we heard about complaints that some people were mad that there were too many black people. So the pool cop said we all had to leave. And then all of a sudden, I saw the cop putting the girl's face in the grass. And we were all scared. And we had to leave because it was getting out of control. So I just felt really scared. And like, we had to leave. It was too crazy. So. After several videos hit national media of a pool party gone wrong, the community decided to come together Monday evening for a peaceful protest. The neighborhood did inform the residents that there will be a peaceful protest and to take a deep breath and allow McKinney PD to complete their investigation via email. Frisco, Allen, Plano, and other surrounding Dallas families came to support the cause and to share their stories. And as black people who pay taxes in McKinney, yeah. 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 for years, who brought our kids here for a better way of life, yeah. how can we get them? Uh, I'm Jahi Adifa Bakari. My daughter was also in the video. She wasn't the one getting hurt so severely. However, I was supposed to be picking her up after school that day to spend the family time together, but they had this organized party. You have to wait till the next day, I was told. What if I had woken up the next day or gotten a call that my daughter was not going to be there? Yeah. Right. Yeah. And I'm with you on Officer Case Boat needs to go, but the whole police department needs to be reformed. Yeah. Because one yeah. rotten apple destroys it all. Most citizens were concerned about what will happen next and what will be done to ensure that this won't happen again in the future. Some of the concerns that, for the most part, the concerns are when you move to a community and you think that you're in a great area, great opportunity, peaceful, diverse, and then for something like this to happen and hit home for you, um, it draws a concern of what the future of our community is going to look like. More candid conversations about race and cut to the chase and cut to the root of the problem because without addressing the root, then nothing gets solved. I think in the future the adults should consult the adults on this issue, not a whole bunch of teenage kids and the adults that fought an 18 year old wasn't right at all. You should never take it to that serious. You guys are 30 year old. You guys are 30 years old fighting an 18 year old that wasn't right. I want you to exert whatever energy that you have. Write a letter, send emails, flood the phones. Yes. Get this dude fired. Yes. This dude does not yes. Yes. So after a peaceful protest, the citizens just want peace. I'm India Foster reporting for the Downtown Tea TV.